Okay, so today I'm going to do the next one. So I'm going to do the next one. Let's get to it. Um, the winner is Make a Letter to House that spells the name Leo. Okay, so we're going to do that. Okay, so see you in a bit. So, as we've been told from that last little clip, um, we are going to be making the, um, what's it called? A house that spells my cat's name. If you didn't know, my cat's name is Leo. Um, and, yeah, we're just going to... I don't think I've ever seen anybody do this, like make a house that spells a name. Um, but we obviously are going to be doing that. So, as you can see, we have already started and um, we have done the L and we are doing the E now. We do shrink it down a little bit um, because, can, as you can see, I don't think we'll be able to fit the O. Um, so I was like, I'll shrink it down because why not? Um, it's and then I, I wanted to like put, um, like a nice little part, um, what's it called? A nice little fence around the whole kind of house. Just to keep like people out, I guess. Um, as you can see, they're not all connected, so you're gonna have to walk outside. If it's raining, if it's snowing, if it's because I tried to connect it here, but I was like, it just looks so stupid. So I was like, no mind. I'll just do it so they have to walk like the tiniest bit ever. Um, and yeah. So this is the part where we size down the actual kind of build. Um. But, yeah, it ends up looking great anyway, um, and I really like it, like, I really like it, like, really, really, really like it, but we're not here to talk about how much I like the name Leo, or how much I like the, well, we are sort of here to look at how much I like the house, but we're not fully here to see that, so, I do love this house only because it spells my cat's name. Um, if your name is Leo, probably not, but if it is, that is actually great. Um, and just comment in down below because um, it'd be very interesting to know who it's actually named that. So yeah, um, just comment it down below. Anyway. Uh, I was going, I split this room, like, this house up, so those, like, the, on the L, the two little rooms are two separate bathrooms, um, and the bigger room in the, like, by one of the small rooms is going to be the bedroom, and then the other gap is just, like, an entrance kind of place, and yeah, um, in the E, it's like the living room and dining room. And then in the O, there's like a little study. And then there is a bar. And yeah. I think it ends up turning out looking really nice. Um, we do add something in the middle of the O because I was like, it's very empty. We should add something. Because why not? Um, it's not going to kill anyone, is it? So I did do that. Um, so, um, we ended up having like a little barbecue area inside and, um, As you can see, I've already done the kind of, um, what's it called? The study area, and I think it looks very nice. Um, I wanted them to be a bit different in colour kind of thing, but it's still the same type. I am sort of, 
Um, so not everything's exactly the same, basically. Um, and then I was, like, struggling on what to build on the other side of the O. So I was like, I'll fill out everything else and see what we could put there. Um, and, yeah. So we did do that. And, um... So you already know basically the plan of the floor, the the floor plan. Um, so you basically know the floor plan um, already. But, you know, I think it looks very nice. If you don't, comment down below why and what I could have, what you would have done to, like, furnish it. Like, how you would have furnished it. What would you have in each letter. And also what I could do to improve my content because i do read your feedback and i do try to comment on all of yours um so yeah i do try but you know yeah so um we do a lot of clutter because i don't think i do enough um so I was like, why don't I just fill it with clutter? Because in a house, you always have clutter. Like, you always have, like, some kind of plant pot, some kind of picture frame on the wall, some kind of, like, ornament on the table or candles or something in the TV stand. You know what I mean? So, yeah, there is always something like that. Um, and I was like, let's just fill this place with plants. Because it is a really big place and it was very hard to fill. I'm just being honest here. It was very hard to fill. So I decided that I was going to just put plant pots. Because plant pots look nice, first of all. They make it feel nice. They make you feel like... I don't really know. They make you feel safer, I guess. They make you feel like decorated and it just feels a lot nicer um so yeah um i already knew what i was gonna put in the l well i didn't already know but i figured it out the minute i did the l because obviously the floor plan and i did need to know as you can see here we had to extend it because of the bar um and I think in the end it does look great. I really do like the way this house turns out. And I say this for every kind of video that I really like the way this house turns out. I really like the way that this character turns out. I really like, you know, you know what I mean? Well, but I really do mean it. Like, I wanted to put them inside, but I was like, it wouldn't let me. So, like, the mailbox wouldn't go in. So I was like, why am I going to put the bin in and then nothing else? So I didn't put that in anyway. It's <laughs> so yeah um i did want something to be in those kind of areas and as you can see i obviously did something um so it's like a little music kind of studio kind of area and then i wanted to put something on the other side as you can obviously see and i was like i don't really know what to put in but I figured it out in the end. And in the end I figured it out. And yeah. So I was just like, I'll put some stuff on the bar just to make it look like it's meant to be there. And yeah. So I wanted to put some like stuff that you could work out on the other side, as you can see. And yeah. I hope you guys do enjoy this build actually. Um, in here I put like a mini gym, just a little gym, just like somebody want, like is bored or has nothing to do, you can just show them the gym. Um, and then I gave them a little bathroom, if you have kids you can like get rid of this bathroom and then like add another one, I'm not sure, or you could take away the bath, the, both of the bathrooms, ex expand like the, um, the one with by the entrance and make that as in the child's room or you and then you could like get rid of the wall and then just like have it so it's like lined up and then you could just put a little room for a bathroom it's up to you um 
but yeah i really like the way this house has turned out i'm not even kidding right now i really do love it um i was really struggling with like the roofing so um i'm very sorry that is really bad like it's not really bad but it isn't the best <laughs> not gonna lie there but it wasn't the best really wasn't the best um i really didn't like the roofing to be honest just being honest with you guys um tell me what your like in in the comments down below tell me what your favorite part about this house was um here i realized you couldn't do anything so yeah that's great i was just like i can do that so it's like lighted up from the bottom and then yeah just had to put some windows in and put the outside wallpaper in so i guess i hope you guys did enjoy this kind of uh, speed build and um like if you did enjoy it and you want to see more comment your favorite um and if your name's leo um subscribe if you haven't already hit the notification bell so you don't miss next time i post a video I post every Mondays to Fridays and um, on my second channel. Go follow that. It's called Vlogger Cat. I'll try and link it in the description if I remember. I'm sorry if I don't because I seem to keep forgetting. Very sorry about that. But like, comment, and subscribe. And yeah. So I do give you this overview. Um, but yeah. Thanks for watching and bye!